Welcome back to my channel. My name is Venetia Alexander Marshall and welcome. If you are new here, hi, how are you? Don't forget, hit the subscribe button at the bottom and make sure you're clicking the notification bell so every time I'm uploading a new video, you are notified. I know you see some of this stuff over here and I'm just gonna move that over here because I don't need nobody trying to see my address. I don't need y'all seeing nothing. But I'm bringing you guys a haul. I have so much makeup i have recently purchased i have makeup it's been sitting in the box forever forever ever forever ever and i'm just now taking it out the box today for you guys so yes i have products from nyx elf i got products from makeup revolution and i also picked up some products from alta and sephora so right now the Sephora VIB sale is currently going on. By the time this video go up, however, the Sephora VIB sale will be over with. I'm just letting you know. So don't be trying to go out there looking for the Sephora VIB sale because when this video go up, it's going to be over with. It will be over with. Just get yeah, it. It will be over with. But I, I, I spent too much money with Sephora. I'm just letting you know. So if you want to know about me and Sephora, I am Rouge. So I get just that much stuff from Sephora and you know a little help from my husband as well because he needs his colognes and things but that's no here nor there so yeah i have so much stuff that we're going to go through and of course i have my glasses on i gotta see i gotta see so let's go ahead and let's get started this one is already opened um this is from who is this from mega revolution i kind of forgot i had made an order from uh makeup revolution I, I, I really did forget I had an order from Makeup Revolution. But I'm going to show you guys what I did get from Makeup Revolution. That's so sad of me that I got stuff and don't even know what I got. Don't even know who I got it from, when I ordered it, or anything like that. So I did pick up a few items from uh, Makeup Revolution. What I did pick up, I did pick up this highlighter. Is this a highlighter? Yes, this is their powder highlighter. Um, yeah, this is their highlighter reloaded in time to shine. Um, so I did pick this up. Look how glistening this is. This is glistening. Oh, wow. So yeah, I did pick up this highlighter from Makeup Revolution. I also picked up this Revolution Balm Glow for the face. So I'm assuming this is a blush in flushed pink. Uh, this is what it looks like. This is what I got. Again, I forgot I had this. I did. I, I did forget I had this. Um, let me see what this looks like. Okay. This looks like it's in a tin can. This is what it looks like. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Definitely. It's like a blush in a tin can. That's what this looks like. It's a blush in a tin can. Ah, okay. So I'm going to be trying that out. Hopefully it's my shade. I don't know. It's going to look like that thing would be my shade. What y'all think? That look like it'd be my shade. Y'all tell me. I don't know. I also picked up from Mega Revolution their bronze, their powder bronzer. This is the shade Dark. Um, So I did pick up their Dark bronzer. I don't know. And you know me, bronzing is more for all over for me. I don't contour to chill it out of contour. I have to be in a mood for that. But the biggest thing I wanted to know, a lot of people have been talking about this Makeup Revolution Skin Silk Luminous Serum Foundation. The shade I have is F15. I don't know if it's going to be my shade. I don't know. Their shade range can be a little shoddy sometimes with Makeup Revolution, but I did get the shade F15. So we're gonna try it out and we're gonna see. So this is gonna be one of the things I will be testing next with the amount of makeup I got. So this is another one I will be testing out. Did I get something else? This is actually so pretty. I did, I knew it was something else I had. I ain't done with Makeup Revolution. I knew it was something else. Like why is this box so heavy? Oh, I got two of these? Oh, okay, wait a minute. Hold on, y'all. Oh, I did get this, y'all. I, I totally forgot. Only I've been talking about how good this setting spray was from Makeup Revolution. This is the Makeup Revolution Super Fix Super Hold Misting Spray. So I did pick this up. I told you I got this stuff and I totally forgot what I had. I'm going to try this out. Definitely see how this works. 
I did pick up a lipstick from Makeup Revolution. Ooh, I love this new packaging. Oh, this packaging. I like this packaging. Oh, I'm very impressed with the packaging. Um, the shade I have, and I got glasses on this time. What's the shade? Brown. Let me see. This is the shade I have. It's a brown shade. We're gonna see. Some browns work on me. And most of the time, a lot of browns do work on me. As long as it's not too dark, it works. This is like a free sample that I got. What is this? Oh, this is their face glow. Okay, I didn't know I had this. This is the Makeup Revolution Bright Light Face Glow I got in the shade Tan. This almost looks like the another dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury. We're going to have to find out and see what this is all about. So, okay, now I just got everything from Makeup Revolution. So now I can move on. Okay, next. Yeah, okay, since so this is like, let me go ahead and put this up. Let's go to, yeah, that goes down there. All right, so next, I'm going to lean this to the side because I don't need y'all seeing my address. This is from, I believe, NYX. This is from NYX. I'm going to be very honest with you guys. <laughs> I ordered this doing Super Bowl. Oh, and this is sad that I'm just now opening it in April. This was the Super Bowl. This was when Cardi B did a collab with them for Super Bowl. And I picked up a few things. Oh, I got quite a bit of stuff. Okay. All right. Okay, yeah, I got quite a bit of stuff. Okay, let's see what I got. Okay, I got quite a bit. All right. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. This was one of them that they talked about. This is the Duck Plump Lip Glosses. I got two shades. I got number four and number seven, Mocha Me Crazy and Opry, Apricot. Not like, like apricot. But these are the two I did get. This is supposed to be a plumping gloss that I got. So I did get these two shades. We're going to see. Plumping glosses. I'm not all that a big fan of plumping glosses. Because sometimes plumping glosses can stink your lips. I also got the Fat Oil Slick Click. It's because I am so in love with the original Fat Oil that I have. Y'all, I love that fat oil that I have. I wear it all the time. So I got it in the stick form. So we'll see about that. I also got the NYX Blur Sunscreen. This is supposed to be a primer. The Blur Screen Primer, yes. It has SPF 30 in it. So I did pick this up. And I also picked up, I wasn't a fan of the primer. So I got the setting spray. This is the marshmallow setting spray from NYX. Not a fan of the marshmallow primer, but I did get the setting spray because a lot of people say that setting spray is pretty doggone good. So we'll see because, again, I was not a fan of that primer. All right, next is, is a very small package. I only ordered a few things. This is from uh, e.l.f. Um, I did not bring my e.l.f. makeup look just yet or my e.l.f. makeup review because e.l.f. just released some new stuff. So I decided just to hold off and wait until I got this. So I did get, because this is just recently when I ordered this, I did get a new sponge. Oh, it bent. This is the new sculpting sponge from um, e.l.f. and it bent. But I did pick up this from e.l.f. I love their sponges. Their sponges are one of my absolute favorites. I absolutely love their sponge. I also did pick up the e.l.f. This is their primer infused bronzer. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this looks too light. This is gonna be too light. Yeah, this is too light. This is supposed to be the dark shade. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you right now, this too light. This is gonna be too light, but I'm not gonna be able to deal with it. Mm -mm. That's too light for me. The biggest thing I picked up from them is their new e.l.f. This is their Power Grip Dewy Setting Spray. This was the reason why I held off on my e.l.f. Uh, makeup review because I saw this was being released. I ordered it 
and I got it. This is the biggest reason, again, why. And I think you have to shake this up to activate it. So here it is. So I did get this. So I'm, now I'm going to bring you my e.l.f. makeup review. I don't know about that bronzer. That bronzer not going to be a friend of mine. I can tell you that right now. Me and that bronzer not, me and that bronzer not going to get along. I'm sorry, y'all. Me and that bronzer not going to get along. All right, next is Ulta. Now, I'm going to tell you why I'm going to do Ulta is because of a new makeup brand that I saw being released on Ulta. If you have not paid attention, um, probably one of the greatest in the tennis world of all time, Serena Williams, has just released her own makeup brand. So I did pick up a few items from her new makeup brand. So that's why I placed the order. But apparently I had a lot of other stuff in my cart. Also from Ulta. But when I saw this stuff from Ulta with her makeup line. Oh, I had to have it, y'all. I had to absolutely have it. And then they had to split it up to me. I got a box and then I got this package too. Because uh, I think in the package is just her lip product. I think... Let me see. I think it's just a lip out. I'm kind of looking to the side because I'm like, man, I'm already running out. Okay, battery light. Okay, hello. Yeah, this is just her lip product. All right, so I did get her new Win Beauty Word of Mouth. This is her matte lipstick. This is what I picked up. The shade, what shade did I get? I don't know which shade I got. Okay, I don't know. This is so tiny, but this is the shade I got. This is what it looks like. It looks like the color of a tennis ball. This is her brand. This is, oh yeah. I think I'm going to like that. I'm going to like that shade, yeah. I'm going to like that. Oh, I'm going to like that shade. But yeah, this is so unique because it's in the color of a tennis ball. And look at that, that's so sleek. So when I saw Serena Williams had her own makeup line, oh wait, hold on, wait a minute, hold, hold, hold on, I need to go get that. So I got this, I also got her Win Beauty Hydrating Skin Enhancing Tint. This is a skin tint with SPF 30. So here it is, this is the brand. I am excited to try it out. And this had a lot of shades. There was a nice little shade range that uh, she had. This is what the skin tint looks like. And look at that. It's super bright because, again, it is the shade of a tennis ball. Um, I don't know if you all can see at the bottom that that's what I got. So I could not wait. I will be bringing you a definite review of this new brand from uh, Win Beauty by Serena Williams. I've been following Serena Williams since she first started playing tennis and even when it was her sister Venus and then when Venus and Serena would play, oh my goodness. I also got, what else did I get? I got a concealer, hey, a Win Beauty Nothing to See Soft Matte Cream Concealer and I also got her Tubing Mascara. So here it is, this is what they both uh, look like again the color is the color of a tennis ball this is the concealer this is what it looks like i'm taking it out of the packet oh nice look at that concealer real nice this is definitely going to be for brightening and now we're going to look at the mascara oh yeah this is the mascara See what that looks like. Yep. All right. Can't wait to try that out. Win Beauty. And because I made a purchase of Win Beauty products, I did get a free uh, makeup bag that did say it that does say Win Beauty by Serena Williams. The other products I did pick up from Alt. Yeah, from Ulta. I did pick up, I saw this, um, I believe it was Juicy, was it Juicy Jazz? Or Kelly Strack. One of them tested this primer out. I wanted to try it out. This is from LA Girl. This is the LA Girl Blurring 
putty primer. And they're trying to copy the e.l.f. poreless putty primer and of course the original itself which was the Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. So I did pick that up just to see what it would be like. And then I also picked up a couple of things. This is from CoverGirl. This is the CoverGirl um, Skin Protector. This is their, what is this? Everybody's talking about that. This is like a skin tip, but looks what it looked what it looked like. Got them little beads in it. So yeah, I decided to test this out. I'm gonna tell you, I don't know. This look a little too dark. This might be too dark for me. So I don't know about that. That might be too dark for me. And then I got a lip gloss. I had this in my cart forever. This is the CoverGirl Clean Fresh Yummy Gloss. I don't know why it took me so long to get it, but I finally got it, guys. I don't know about that from CoverGirl. That might be too dark. Too dark. Okay, we'll see. So yeah, this is everything I got from Ulta. All right, guys, here are the big daddies. This is Sephora. Here's Sephora box number one. Here is Sephora box number two. We're just gonna start opening because I think one is mostly the Sephora collection. I believe it's mostly the Sephora collection. One of them is a repurchase because I get this all the time from uh, Sephora. Is this it? Yep, this is it. Okay, a repurchase that's from the Sephora collection. This is the Sephora collection. They're hydrating cleansing wipes. I get these a lot and their cleansing wipes are really, really, really good. Um, and I go through these a whole, whole lot. I also got, also from the Sephora collection, this is the lip pencil I got. This is the dark shade of the lip pencil, also from the Sephora collection. But I also decided to have a little fun and picked up a couple of other things. In this box, this is from LYS. This is their higher standard, this is their blush stick. So I did pick this up from LYS. What shade did I have? Here it is right here. Unfazed. It is the shade I have, Unfazed. And y'all been talking about this. So I decided to try it out. I got the foundation back there. What is this? Is this a tinted moisture? No. Oh yeah, this is it. This is from Say Beauty. This is their slip tint concealer here it is i have the foundation i never opened the foundation yet and i was about to open the foundation till i saw they had this concealer okay you know what i'm gonna hold up on that safe beauty foundation because now they got that concealer so now that's box number one from sephora now i'm about to open box number two again when this video goes up the sephora vib sale will be over with overall that's using my discounts and everything yeah i see because it. it is not hard spending a lot of money at Sephora. It is not hard at all to go crazy at Sephora. The craziest I've ever gone, I know I spent $500. Easy. Easily spent $500 at Sephora. And my kids looked at me nuts. My husband just shook his head. So, <laughs> so this is the big one. I got a lot. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff in here. All right. Let's start off. Number one. This is the new Makeup Forever HD Hydra Glow Foundation. This is the one with the white top. Did I get the same? I think it's the same shade I'm in in the other one. N 4N62. Um, I keep forgetting I have that other foundation in there. And I saw this. I said, okay, let me go ahead and try this. But this is what the foundation looked like. Ooh. I don't know if they're going to match me. My. But here it is. I did pick up the new foundation from Makeup Ever. What else I got? This that I have here. All right. I'm biased. I'm biased. I'm biased. I am absolutely, totally loving and been in love with the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Concealer for years. I'm about to run out of that one again. And I need to get me a new two. But a lot of people were not a fan of that Pro Filter Concealer. But she decided to release this concealer. This is the We're Even um, 
Hydrating Concealer from Fenty Beauty. I got the same shade I'm in in the other one for 10. We gonna see. We, we, we. We gonna see. Because I have been loving the original concealer for so many years. But again, I know, here it is. This is the packaging. I know a lot of people were not a fan of that concealer. And a lot of people are a fan of this concealer. We gonna see. That's all I'm gonna say is, we gonna see. We gonna see. I am super excited about this concealer. All I got to say is, it's about time y'all come out with some concealer. Okay? It's about time y'all come out with some concealer. Because I have both of y'all foundations. I have y'all cream the powder foundation, your stick foundation. I got your blush. I got yeah, I got your uh, highlighter. Oh, uh, what else I got? Oh, your lip products. It's your setting spray. Not, not setting spray. Setting powder. What else I got? Setting powders. Bronzer. Baby. When I saw Fashion Fair had a new concealer out. Yes. Yes. This is the new concealer from Fashion Fair. Well, what took you so long, Fashion Fair? What took you so long? This is the shade Almondine. Almondine. I think that's how you pronounce it. This is the concealer. Again, Fashion Fair. Fashion Fair. Fashion Fair. Oh, Fashion Fair. What took you so long to get you some concealer? What took you so long? I'm finally excited y'all got some concealer baby thank you thank you because i've had to use other concealers with your products and i'm like i wish they come out with a good now i'm gonna need y'all to come out with a mascara a eyeshadow palette and a set spray that's what i'm gonna need you to come out with next okay okay but i'm excited Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. look how this is. Y'all will ignore my nails. They are busted. I'm about to do my nails when I get done with this video. In the meantime, yes. Look at that sleek packaging. Yes. It's about time y'all come out with some concealer. What took you so long, Fashion Fair? What took you so long? What else did I get? Okay. This is the new blush from House Labs. I got the shade what shade did I get? Watermelon Bliss from House Labs. I did pick up this uh, this blush. Now, I'm just now starting to get back into her bronzer. Um, I do have her foundation and concealer. The foundation is a the shade. The foundation shade I have is a hair too dark. I have not tried the concealer yet. It wears well. It's just a little dark on me. Uh, but this is the new blush from House Labs. Ooh, pretty. We gonna see, girl. We gonna see. Okay, all right, House Labs. We gonna see. But this is the shade Watermelon Bliss. So we gonna see. We 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 gonna see. We gonna see y'all. We gonna see because we will be testing out a lot of this makeup. In the coming weeks, we will be testing out this makeup. Not done yet. I finally picked this up. I'm gonna see how good this is because y'all talked about these people blush. Oh, this is the best blush in the world. I don't particularly care for it. So now I got one of these lip glow oils from Dior. What did I get? I don't even remember what shade I got, y'all. Oh, I got the dark one. So I got the lip glow oil. I got the cherry oil. This is it from uh, Dior. So I did pick this up. We gonna see. We we gonna see. Cause y'all said that blush was banging. I don't care for that blush. I really don't care for that blush. I, I, I just use it just to get rid of it. Hurry up and get rid of it. I'm just not a fan of it. Not at all. Last but not least. Now I heard these are good. I heard these were good. We're going to see how good it is. This is from Huda Beauty. This is the Huda Beauty Faux Filler Lip Gloss. This is the shade Coco that I have. Here it is. This is what I have. Let's see. Because I have been hearing very good things about these 
new glosses from Huda. And so far, it's a lot of things from Huda Beauty I'm not disappointed with. I think the only thing I'm still a little on the fence with is the Glow Concealer that is currently on my face right now because I just recorded this video. Uh, let's play with makeup. I'm still on the fence with this. Not sure yet. Um, I'm trying to take it out and I think I'm breaking the packaging because I got to fix my nails. Here we go. Okay. I just broke it. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and just leave it out. Okay. Ooh. Look at the packaging. Oh. Ooh. Let's see. Because I heard these are good. my haul of Sephora, Ulta, NYX, Makeup Revolution, and Elf. So I will be bringing you these makeup reviews in the coming weeks with all of these new products. So with that being said, this is Venetia Alexander Marshall. I hope you have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.